Académie Versailles 2018 offers international masterclasses for singers and harpsichordists and is uh, focused entirely on the French Baroque opera repertory. It is organized as additional program of the Summer Festivities of Early Music, International Music Festival, in very close, long-standing, fruitful collaboration with Centre de Musique Baroque de Versailles and the French Institute. Le belta, instead of bel, belta, belta, it is more rather in front. 26 young, talented musicians, students, young professionals came uh, from all over the world to Prague to study French Baroque music with five lecturers, renowned specialists in the field of solo vocal performance and vocal technique, uh, gesture and scenic aspects of performance, harpsichord and basso continuo, pronunciation and declamation of French, and pronunciation and declamation of Italian. The partnership with Prague for Versailles is very interesting because the way of working is more or less the same. That means we go fast. We try to find the best solution to each problem to give to the audience and to the musician the best as we can for the music. Because this music, I think, is a symbol of Europe. French music was very known at the time, played everywhere in Europe, and so nowadays, I think if Europe can find interest in French music, we will have a strong Europe. French music is particular because it's a question of language, a question of style, a question linked with the choreography also. And so you cannot only bring the music, I think. You have to bring the spirit. So you begin there. The music begins. This is like the opening of the curtain. You come around. Hey, guys. This work is um, important because also traditionally it is a little bit overlooked in the, uh, you know, during the schooling of these singers. But sometimes they don't have this kind of experience in the institutions where they learn singing. Usually the first um, rehearsal is a bit of a surprise and then we sort of find a common language and then they react very quickly because they are stimulated on the same pieces from so many points of view that um, for one time the staging and the declamation and the singing technique is coming together. This is a fantastic opportunity to get really deep into French Baroque music. So it's been fantastic uh, to be here and to hear these wonderful professors and performers and really top musicians, you know, really authorities on their fields and to be able to uh, speak with them, to share ideas and to get, pe uh, to, get to know people from all over the world. Um, what I find amazing about this time that I spent here in Prague is that uh, is really the quality of the teachers. And so never rushing to the end, mm -hmm. never rushing. Mm -hmm. You were frequently, too frequently rushing to the end. As a harpsichordist, not only the harpsichord lessons are interesting and the accompaniment lessons are interesting, but sitting into the lessons for singers is quite interesting uh, in terms of gesture, uh, diction, and also in terms of vocal technique is particularly interesting because I will perhaps be a coach uh, in the near future and all of this information that is told to the singers I can reuse uh, when I am working with singers myself. So it is really just generally a great program. I highly recommend it for harpsichordists as well as singers. And if you do Verrenier, and then the color of Verrenier. Exactly. The festival, Summer Festivities of Early Music, as organizer of Academia Versailles, is very happy and proud of creating such a great opportunity for all the participants and uh, such exceptional and very rare event here in Prague.